Welcome back, everyone. I am Brian, you records in Notes Nation. This is Vanny Babiola with an Engelbert Humperdinck song, Please Release Me. I remember Engelbert. My mom used to listen to him uh, a long, long time ago, decades ago. I remember as a child hearing, and, and I remember this song, and I remember her singing this song. I have to call her and <laughs> tell her about this one. Um, yeah, so cool. So when I saw that she did this, and I know it was three days ago, but when I saw that she did this, I'm like, yeah, cool. Because uh, she's usually she's usually covering like Celine Dion type type songs, and, and that's kind of worn itself out with me. I want to hear different songs, and uh, I'm glad that she took this one on, and I'm very much looking forward to it. If you are new here, welcome. Have a seat. You are in my living room. You are joining me for this. Uh, wonderful, wonderful experience listening to her beautiful voice. Um, have a seat. Please like, subscribe, and share. That will grow this channel. That will get her more exposure. Uh, super thanks are available. Donation requests are available. And my Patreon, Patreon uh, site, Chords and Notes Nation, is up and running. And I have patrons. And I have many, many, many things going on there. There are There is one free membership level and there are three paid membership levels, and there's a seven-day free membership trial involved there, too. So much going on there. There is a Chords and Notes Nation uh, Teespring store, or now it's spring, and uh, I do have a Kopi Mana Kopi mug available. For those of you who are interested, check out all that information in the description box below. Shall we? We shall. All right, Vanny.
wonderful, beautiful. I love how she enunciated and she, she, she just took a nice, slow, steady approach to the song. Such good control. Uh, her, just <laughs> so amazing what she does with her voice. And it, it's got this, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's got this, uh, it's got this coloration to it that is so distinctive. And when she she sings so high like that, it feels like it's brittle and it might break. You know? It it's just it's but it's just so crisp and clear. Um and it just makes me like it gave me chills. There were certain times when the notes she was hitting just had a physiological effect on me. That's crazy, man. <laughs> it's freaking crazy, but that's that's the beauty of music. That's the blessing of music that God gave us, right? It's this ability to communicate, to cross so many barriers, to cross so many, uh, uh, to overcome a lot of limitations, um, and and to be able to make connections with people across the world. I've never met this in, this person, and she's she's only on a television screen. Her image and her voice. Uh, but yet it's able to, to, these sound waves are able to generate physiological and emotional responses. It's pretty amazing, folks. It really is what God's given us. Don't take it for granted. And she certainly hasn't. I, I, I enjoy the fact that she, she went after this song and she sang it with such professionalism and with, with such ease. That's the other thing. It just seems so easy for her. Smooth, controlled. It's wonderful, but she doesn't sing better than my mom. Nobody does. Well, she's my mom. What can I say? Don't hate me for that. <laughs> All right. God bless you guys. Jesus loves you. I'll talk to you later.